My party is a wonderland. Let's talk about that. Good mythical morning. The bathroom is where I do all my thinking. It's my temple for quiet contemplation. But mm -hmm. sometimes it gets boring in there and you gotta spice things up with some cool bathroom gadgets. It's time for Weird Products You Must Have Bathroom Edition. Rhett, how do you rinse your mouth out after you brush your teeth? Uh, I'm a cupper, I'm a hand cupper. Oh yeah? Cupper and a supper. I, I thought you'd be like a giraffe awkwardly trying to drink from a stream. I used to before I realized I could use my hands. Well, neither one of those are great options compared to the rinser brush, a toothbrush that doubles as a water fountain by directing your faucet right into your mouth. Okay, I've got my hands on one right here, even though it's not available to the public yet. We reached Ooh. out to Scott Amron, the creator, so it's available for pre-order at amronexperimental.com. Wow. Uh, um, interesting thing here, uh, for just under $12, whenever it comes out, you don't have to bend over as far or use that cupping mechanism. Allow me to demonstrate in our uh, Would you like me to cut in our sink. Off? This sink has always been here. You just haven't noticed it. Yeah, so turn that on. And instead of doing your, your cup thing, it's, it's got a button where the water runs through here. You rinse off the end of your toothbrush. But then if you want to get a little sippy sip, you push the button and it, run, it runs a little jet or like a fan. So I'm going to turn that on. Woo -ho -ho! Oh, oh, look at that. Oh, party time. Let me get a little. Look at that. You can drink it from a toothbrush. It tastes like normal water. Whoa, keep it in the sink, Link. No, oh, it's on my sleeve. <laughs> keep it in the sink. Look at that. That's pretty cool, man. So that's not just gravity doing that. There is a jet in there. Okay, now, um, I gotta say, mm. I may be done cupping. Yeah, my you cup, are. My cupping days are, are over. over. But, you know, I'm also a fan of the bidet, but I don't have one in my actual bathroom. They're pretty expensive to install. Um, but when I saw that water jet streaming, it gave me an idea. Um, okay. Good thing I've got my prosthetic fanny on. <laughs> oh, my word. <laughs> there so, it is. Link, uh, now you're gonna need a friend for this. Uh, which is, that could be a little awkward, but I could probably learn how to get coordinated enough to do this to myself. Yeah, I... Bidet me, Link. I am not this friend, am I? <laughs> Just like, it's not my actual butt. No, it's not. Okay. <laughs> it doesn't tickle at all. I just feel like I should do that for effect. There we go. All right. Let me see if I can do it. Let me guide yeah. it. Let me see if you can do it yourself. Now, I mean, where's don't that. Where's the stream of water? You don't need to poop in the sink. You can you can poop in a toilet. Help, help, but direct, help direct it. Move over to the. There it is. Oh yeah. It's pretty precise, now so. Let, now let go. You might need some mirror work, you know? Of course, I mean, typically there would be a mirror here, so. Okay. There you go. Wow, clean as a whistle. <laughs> <laughs> Next up, the potty piano, a toilet mat that doubles as a piano. Well, we need a toilet for this one. Hey, I'm sitting on one. There you are. Studies show that pooping can be boring. You don't want your phone in your hand while you're pooping, because. Sometimes it'll drop right that little that little crack right there, <laughs> right? That's right, happened to right. the best of us, and that's why we got the potty piano. Now you can make music while you're making a duty. I wore my pants over my pants today. Just you know, I've already shown. I thought your legs were really dark. Yeah, yeah. I've already shown. <laughs> uh, and I'm glad my that... my butt. That isn't really my butt, but this is these are not actual legs. This is just jeans. But as you can see, play it. I can play anything, I just don't really know how to play the piano. <laughs> and I'm kinda, it's a little bit limiting. You've got a couple of options here. You can't play chords, you can just play notes. But, I mean, a couple of things are happening that I'm noticing right now. Number one, I'm getting a little bit of a quad workout as I have to sort of lift the legs. And also, lifting the legs is good for the roids. And I'm talking about the hemorrhoids. Thank you. Because you wanna do this, you wanna do the squatty thing, you know? Now, I, I think it's also limited in the number of keys there are. I mean, yeah, that's, not, that's not 66 keys. I mean, 88. How many? 88? There's not 88 you keys You could probably there. get a couple of extras and go, well, you know, look, that's why, I, look, I can't go any wider because of my, my, my pants. Yes, your shorts over your pants. Exactly, so they thought of everything. And uh, it's only $23 on Amazon. $23 for 
minutes of fun when you're in there in the bathroom. I don't know, this, this one's not clicking into place for me. Okay, well how about this? If you've got one man in a, in a bathroom sitting on a toilet making music, why can't you have two? Link, come and join me. <laughs> All right. Oh, don't, don't trip. Oh, you did the same thing. This is, yeah. <laughs> you uh, got your shorts on over your pants today as well. You also have your shoes still on. That's cool, I'm not gonna ask any questions about it. <laughs> if you look down here, this is no ordinary bath mat. This is uh, a theremin bath mat. Oh. There's a theremin built into this bath mat. And uh, I'm gonna give it a little bit of a go here. Whoa. You're a little it's bit- It's like I'm riding on a spaceship. You're like an expert. Let's play a little something together. We're just two dudes pooping. That's what we're doing. We don't wanna spoil it. But we're just two friends on, on the, the toilet. toilet. <laughs> we're, we're just, just two, two dudes pooping. That's what we're doing. I don't want to spoil it. But we're just two friends on the toilet. Two friends on the toilet? Two friends on the toilet. Yeah. Having fun for $23. Of course, that thing doesn't exist, we just made that. And now the baby shampoo cap. Protect your baby's delicate eyes and ears from the evils of shampoo. Oh, okay. And we got one right here. Now this thing's made out of foam, just shy of $9 on Amazon. Mm -hmm. um, I think this is pretty smart. You put it, I mean, there's a picture here, a really cute picture of it on a baby. Oh. That baby's just like in a meditative state, man. Oh, man, because that, that is a thing, that is a thing. We've had the babies, we know about this. Lando, uh, who's about to turn seven, until he was six, where this says it goes up to age six, he would he hated taking a shower because he, he could not stand to get Anything in its any water, much less shampoo, in his face. And you don't want him to wear goggles in there because that's just weird. But this would need to have like skulls and crossbones. But other than that, would work. You put it on and you put it. It goes over the ears too, and then you snap it. I mean, it's you look. You look like a, a, little, a cowboy that was in an accident. You know, I've been in, the, I've been in an accident. The, the top of the, the hat was blown off. <laughs> but uh, it, it won't quite fit. I, I'm disappointed in that because when I shampoo my hair. I don't like to get shampoo anywhere else. Like I don't want shampoo touching the rest of my body. It, it doesn't seem right, and it seems it seems wasteful, and it also seems wrong. Well, we're you're in luck. <laughs> we're in luck, and you're in luck because we've invented something that will help you with that problem, Link. Ladies and gentlemen, introducing the Shampoo for <laughs> adults who don't want to get shampoo in their eyes or on their body anywhere except their heads. Love it. How's it feel, Link? Uh, muy bien. Is there, is there a nice seal there? Let's test, we'll test it. We're gonna just pre-wet, pre-rinse. Pre Woo! Woo! It's cold, Are brother. you wet, Link? Woo! Uh, is the floor wet? Yeah, my, no, it just went right through the baby pool. My head's wet, yeah. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm shampoo I'm coming in hot! Okay. Or actually room temperature, but. Okay. It's all right. All right, now you, again, you're gonna need to, now I don't think you can actually reach the hair without compromising nope. the system. So Can't get to it, I'm gonna need a friend. You're gonna need a buddy, just <laughs> like the bidet, okay? But that's what I'm here for. Oh goodness. I usually close my eyes and go to sleep when this is happening. Now what do you, what do you, you like circles? Yeah. You like, you like crossies? Uh, circles. Do you like pets? Nails. What do you like, just tell me what you like, I'm here to please. Light nails. Oh really? Light nails in the circles. <laughs> now, that's it. One thing you're going to notice is that the sideburns and the back of the hair are going to be completely untouched. <laughs> that's cool. But based on my experience, that never gets dirty. It doesn't. I don't have much hair there anyway. That's right. Light circles, and I like to, I like to thin it out like that. And now, I'm going to need to do something. I'm going to need another buddy. Can wipe have another wipe buddy? that on the shampoo. All right, now this is where the third buddy comes in and washes the hands of the, the second buddy. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. Okay, now okay, buddy. buddy number one comes back in you, buddy. and rinses. How nice, how, how nice is this? Oh, it's going down the back of my pants. <laughs> How's that happening? 
Oh, How's it going down the back of my pants? I got it. I'm holding it. I, well, got, I, I got you, buddy. It's going down the back of my shirt. <laughs> Stop. Gotcha. All right. <laughs> All right. We're, we're sti it's still in development. We'll, I mean, the whole... What happened? <laughs> Sorry. Well, I think maybe you needed a size extra at large. Man, thank you for liking, commenting, and subscribing. You know what time it is. Hi. My name is Zerina from the Philippines, and it's time to spin the wheel of mythicality. If you want to spend more time in the bathroom, well, you know, coffee has a laxative effect, and coffee can be put into a mythical mug. Available at redlink.com slash store. Click through to Good Mythical More. We're going to play a game with the crew to investigate their bathroom habits. Win face! Congratulations to Becca Copeman. You win a mythical hoodie. Wow! They exist. Yes. Just don't have one currently. There's they a do. picture. Yeah. We, we can put pictures up. We've got the technology. There's a picture. Congratulations, Becca. Click on the left to watch our show after the show, Good Mythical More. Click on the right to watch another episode of Good Mythical Morning. And click the circular channel icon to subscribe. Thanks for being your mythical best.